Alright, hello, welcome to our E3 smash prediction slash discussion slash whatever the hell. Um, everyone introduce yourself. I am Mr. 911, uh, probably the most important person you ever meet. Uh, I am Brawl Failure. So, everyone, does anyone have any, like, general, like, predictions or hopes or anything for Smash? Or do you want to get into more specific stuff? Banjo for if Smash. you want to hear my hopes and predictions, you want to go watch my E3 Smash and Predictions video. That, uh, he totally <laughs> uh -huh. didn't steal from Tim. No, shut up. To totally not stolen. <laughs> Alright. Yeah, it's completely right, um, original content. Let's start with, I guess, stages. Are there any stages or, like, particular series you want to see stages from? Like, more obscure things, rather than something that's, like, obviously gonna get it like Mario? Uh... Hmm... It's a little bit strange, but I want to see more of, like, a little darker side, like, dark humors stage, like Binding of Isaac, since... You know, it's... Since there's a lot of stage variety with everything being procedurally generated within the game, you can really have like just anything you want popping through in, popping throughout, like specific enemies or bosses that can pop up occasionally. Yeah. You could almost do something like what um, Mario Maker does, where it like randomly generate or pseudo randomly generates the stage. Yeah. Yeah, that'd be cool. Nah. Bro, you gotta, nah, you gotta have like uh, 50 Fire Emblem stages, right? You know? That's most popular. Yeah. yeah. We've got to get a stage where you fight on Chrome's abs. Oh, that sounds amazing. <laughs> but no, seriously, like, um, I want to see, see, this kind of goes back to, um, maybe the more competitive scene. I kind of want more stages that are optimal for competitive, um, competitive Smash. Oh, uh, yeah, definitely. Oh, yeah. Because there's, like, five of them, like, in Smash 4, and, yeah, you know, I want it. I want something else at least that's uh, optimal for competitive play, which is pretty hard because it's um, there are... that's like I don't know. That's not really putting much on a stage, which I definitely would want to see. Yeah, but there are a lot of different. Yeah, there are a lot of platform layouts and stuff you could do because like, plat like having platform layouts that are reasonable, like will still let the stage be competitive. Whereas something like any other stage that isn't just platforms like yeah and i guess lilac has the tilt but no one likes lilac tilting exactly it you can't really use that yeah so i don't know it's kind of like a mixed bag it's really hard to make a good stage that uh competitive players can also enjoy as well as casual um mm -hmm. but yeah i do i do like some of the casual stages like more um i i kind of like midgar in a way like the idea of um, different like monsters or different um, attacks being put onto the stage, making the stage change up a little bit. Um, kind of like um, mm. what was it called Spear Pillar from Brawl? Yeah. Drawing yeah. a blank because I haven't played Brawl in a hot minute. Yeah. It's uh. It's... Um. Was Ragnar was was Ragnar Ferox a legal stage and uh? Did 3DS brawl, or in 3DS uh, Smash 4? Um, because I, really, I can't. Remember. Well, no one plays 3DS, I really like so. <laughs> I got him. Yeah, I didn't. I didn't play tournaments when during for, 3DS for days. A pretty uh, looked like three months or like a month and a half for like a couple days. Mm hmm. I know the Colosseum on Wii U was definitely not legal because it had a runoff. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, I really. One thing I. I liked um Ragnaferox, and I really hope they bring like a stage similar to that back, like Pokemon Stadium. Is a Pokemon Stadium legal in Smash 4? No. No. Oh. No, it's Rip. it's not. <laughs> yeah. Unfortunately. I would love a stage that's kind of separated into two separate stages almost, like kind of two islands, but yeah. I, like still but that, in a way that might that kinda, potentially be that legal. That kind of breaks up but... um, the field for fighting in a way, because if you have... It's kind of like... um, What is it? That Animal Crossing one on 3DS, right? It kind of it slows the action down a bit, and that's not really good for a fighting game. Um, so if, yeah. if you just have like, I guess, but if like... you just have two people on other sides of the island, you know, it's gonna be very boring. It's 
it's encouraging like keep away strategies, and that's not yeah, fun but to watch. I really like keep away strategies. <laughs> Um, I, like, I went on For Glory, like, yesterday, and I thought, I'm just gonna play as campy, like, a campy Link as much as possible, just for fun, because I never did it during the early yeah. days. <laughs> and now I know how to actually play the game properly, it's like, yeah, this is really fun and rude. <laughs> but they already have the, like, it, the Donkey Kong stage, we can go to the background, and that's effectively the same thing. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That back background stage actually looks really fun, but you can't really play on it on its own because sometimes it kind of falls away, and that's yeah, not yeah. cool. <laughs> yeah, like, and it it also punishes players who like try to use the whole runaway option too much uh, with the exploding yeah. barrels part of the stage. I feel like that's a good way to balance a, like a stage with uh, two breakable components. Um, you yeah. feel? I know I haven't played Rivals of Ether, but um, like I think Tim, you've played it, right? Is there any yeah, is there any yeah. like um, dynamic stages that you would like to see kind of like um, modeled a little bit in the new Smash? Kind of like taking rival stages, yeah, taking like inspiration from some of those stages. They're all rival stages. I think the only one just that's need a... notable is the forest one, where it's like where it's basically like an extended an extended elevated platform. That's yeah, I, yeah. That's the only real one that comes up to mind. Mind. Okay, one stage that like from a completely casual, like competitively, fuck that. But from a completely casual, the Tower of Heaven, I think it was, looked really cool. It's because like sometimes it has a certain restriction, like oh you can't touch this block or you can't touch any plants, <laughs> and if you do, it will hurt you. Kind of like the WarioWare stage, but it's in effect decently often, and it keeps you on the same stage. And I feel like that'd be something that Smash could do, and it'd be pretty interesting. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I see what you're saying. I see what you're saying a lot, actually. Um, what was I gonna say? It's another aspect about like more competitive stages could be they could like potentially shake it up a little by throwing a non-conventional choice in there. That's norm, like I think, like just normally illegal. But not, but like barely illegal. So like you could probably like throw like Bayonetta's tower in there, once in a while, just for like funsies to keep viewership up. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Then it kind of gets into the Lilat situation with stage picking, because like, when you're at tournaments, no one chooses Lilat. Well, no one wants to unless their stage does, unless the character does really well, like Pikachu, because Pikachu can abuse the tilts and stuff. Yeah. With quick attack canceling. And you get a situation like that where no one wants to go to it, and it just kind of sits there and like gets banned every time. Or you get the situations where there are people who abuse that, they know no one wants to go to this stage, so I'm going to not ban it, knowing they won't go to it. So like, I feel like it would just end up not being chosen, ever, if yeah. there was a stage yeah. like that. That's fair. But you gotta... I mean, I choose Lila more than most people. Uh -huh. But I also, uh, well, like, I think we also have to take in consideration, um, Smash is more of, like, a casual game. Um, uh, uh, I yeah, guess most of the I'm audience... I'm questioning whether that's going to be this game, Yeah, right? and most of the audience is, like, younger kids, maybe, I don't know, like, fun for the whole family type. So we gotta take Nintendo's audience into consideration with, um... Thinking yeah. it's probably gonna be yeah. more casual. Um, I can dream it. Won't <laughs> I mean, brawl, brawl it didn't look all that casual, and look at what happened to the game. That's true. Yeah. Well, like, all right, modes. Mode. What do you guys think of modes? I want Smash like Tour. I want Smash Tour to be the main mode. <laughs> I feel like I'm, I'm in the extreme minority who actually enjoys. Wait, wait, that playing. wasn't no, a joke. I like Smash no, Tour. I, no, I'm in like. I know. I I like Smash Tour. I feel like I'm the in the extreme minority who genuinely enjoys playing that mode. Damn straight, you're in the wait, minority. Wait, 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 All wait, right, wait. What, why? Are you talking about Smash Tour? It's or? fun. Wait, wait, which one was Smash Tour? Smash Tour. Is that the Mario Party one? It's the Smash board game. Smash Tour is the one. the board game. Oh no, yeah. I like Smash Run. Smash Run's Smash great. Run yeah, best. I love Smash Run too, but. Uh, Smash Tour, ooh, it's a great game mode. No, I, I think it's really fun to play. I never use Smash Tour, honestly. 
I've I've tried. I've really tried to enjoy I, it. I like uh, I used to do it, but not anymore. Because it's just it's so boring. Like That's one of the main reasons why I still boot up Smash 4 just to play Smash Tour. Wow. wow. I've never heard that before. <laughs> <laughs> um, yeah, neither. I also want uh break the uh, normal break the targets mode to come back. Break the targets yeah, is great. Break yeah, break the targets is great. Yeah, but the, the then they literally just made it Angry Birds, and all like, gross. Fuck. Yeah. Fucking, I fucking hate Target Blast. <laughs> it looks and feels so terrible to play. Like, the bomb has, like, super high gravity, and it's gross. Yeah. Mm -hmm. It's so wonky. You never, like, you don't really truly know what's gonna happen with it. And... Yeah. <sighs> I also want, like, some overly unique events. Like, I want, like, a... a Something Giga Bowser esque, like for Melee, but in for Smash mm -hmm. Switch, like I don't know, like a Giga Mario, or you fight ex just uh, Giga Mac, for example. Yeah, I miss Boss Rush. That was fun. I forgot what Boss Rush was. I miss, oh yeah, oh yeah, yeah. Um, from Brawl. I miss Subspace. It's just all the bosses, just one after another. Can we get another oh, Subspace, yeah, 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 please? Another... Like that was oh, that was yeah. one of my favorite modes from Brawl, and they I was so disappointed when they didn't put it back into uh, Smash Four. Like you can yeah. just re you can like remaster it, and like it'll still probably do really well. Yeah. I get why they didn't bring it back because apparently just doing subspace took the same amount of effort as like an entire game worth. Mm -hmm. so, yeah. Like, I doubt they'd redo that, put that effort but back it's... in. But if they did something smaller, like even a three-hour story, yeah, mode, I wouldn't mind that. Yeah, th uh, a three-hour uh, story mode with like even like half the similar proportions of um, I don't know storytelling, I guess, would still like be phenomenal. I think it's, it's I think it's unlikely because considering the fact that um, we've gotten a new Smash this early, I really don't think they would have find found the time to put in subspace. But you know, one can dream. Unless it's a yeah. Point. I hope it's not a port. I I, I really don't think it's a port. I mean, the minority bit, yeah. I mean, I wouldn't mind either, but I just hope it's not a port. I hope it's not. Because then yeah. I wouldn't... Yeah. Since I would have been, you know, good old-fashioned tricked by Masahiro Sakurai. <laughs> That's not even Sakurai. I think... Wouldn't be the first time. I don't know if Nintendo would risk that, though, because if it's a port, everyone's going to be disappointed, right? And... Everyone's yeah. so hyped yeah. for and a new Smash that making the new Smash would really boost Switch sales and really get them a lot of money, so... I don't know, it's a... I don't think it's gonna be a straight-up new game, though. Why not? Oh, yeah, because some new some assets will be reused, like in the case of um, Smash 4 and Brawl. Well, yeah. yeah. But I think it's gonna be like a solid amount is kept. Mm -hmm. But, I don't know. I hope uh, the new. S oh wait, sorry. Oh no, you guys say what you were gonna say. I thought I was just moving on to the next. I was gonna say that I hope that um the Smash Switch encourage more aggressive play since I'm very impatient. Oh uh, yeah, I hard disagree, but I see where you're coming from. Um yeah. But I, as I mentioned before, I kind of enjoy campy play. I'm that nah, guy. Nah, I'm guess. more aggressive as well. I really like aggressive yeah, play. Two to one. But uh, I mean, I can. I mean, I can respect patient players. I like playing Little Mac because it, it lets me be aggressive. Yeah. Does, does Little Mac let you be aggressive? To an extent, you have to have a lot of patience with him too, though, because oh, <laughs> if you're versing someone who's sitting on top platform at Battlefield when you have the, when they have the percent lead, see, what are you gonna do? You're gonna have to sit there for a while and be really patient with how you approach. See, I'm typically like a an aggressive Lucina, which is a pretty like big oxymoron. Uh, so I'm... Lucina's more aggressive than Marth because yeah. you don't have to Lucina works well at close and mid-range whereas Marth has to have that mid-range or else he's kind of yeah. fucked I don't know I want Jigglypuff I... to be not in the video game <laughs> no I, I, I'm not a fan of Puff I like Puff Neither Puff, is, Puff is she has character I like playing you know Puff. you gotta get creative Re replace yeah. Puff with a good Pokemon 
I mean, I don't main a campy character in Smash 4 anyway, but I still prefer camp well, more defensive play, because I play Mewtwo and I basically kind of have to rush in and approach a decent amount unless I want to camp with Shadow Ball, which isn't even optimal in most matchups, but yeah. What was the topic you were going to talk about, Tim? Uh, characters. Like, Favorite characters. I had four topics of, well, four, like, I guess, categories. Unrealistic dream characters, expect, like, well, realistic dream characters, characters you expect to be in, and hated characters that you think have a decent chance of being okay. in. Okay. Alright, Brawl, you All go right. first. Well, uh, kind of like dream characters would be, like, um, Banjo, um, ooh, someone from Bravely Default, because that's pretty, I don't know, that's not, it's kind of, like, underrepresented, honestly. That series is... I don't know. It's kind of overshadowed by a lot of stuff, but I'd like to see it. Fire Emblem. Fire Emblem. <laughs> every, every character from Fire Replace Emblem. Replace Lucina, put Roy. Yeah. Yeah, put every character from Fire Emblem put that it. ever existed in, put in Smash. That'd be my favorite game. <laughs> Just play heroes. Yeah, pretty much. Oh, warriors. That's that's the game. Ke Keaton, yeah. Keaton from Fates from, for Smash, please. That that would make my day. What if they made like the equivalent of Me Sword Spider, but for every Fire Emblem character? So like, oh, they use a sword. <laughs> They're like Me Sword Spider, and it's just a skin for every Fire Emblem swordsman. <laughs> That'd be amazing. Do you um, want the Me characters back? Yes. How really? You? And I want them. To, I want all their move sets and sizes to be legal. I don't. Since I really like the one. See, I really. I like one one two two small. I really do not like the me characters. One one two two small. Can... You don't. No, like I mean it's an interesting idea, but I don't know. It's just the fact that it's so universal, and I don't know. I don't know. I I just don't really like them that much. Why do the me's have arms? Yeah. Why do they have arms? That's my question. <laughs> why do they look like people? The mayo, why are they called me, me when they were on the Wii? Alright, that wasn't why, funny. Why um, didn't you call them me, you, you know? <laughs> Alright. I hate Stop. you. I genuinely. Stop. I disdain Wait, you with a genuine why passion. Why did they rename them to use? <laughs> because we're on the Wii U, right? They could have yeah. been used. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> um, I don't know. That joke's probably been said by someone. But... <laughs> probably, but it's fun. It's it's a funny. It's a funny joke. It's a funny. Tihi. Tihi. Um, um. Oh, dude. Characters, right? So, who I'm expecting? Yeah. Oh, I really want Wolf. I hope they bring Wolf back because everyone was shouting for him, right? Uh, he never got in. I don't know why, but he was so popular. I don't really understand why he didn't get in. But um, I don't know. I feel like in the back of my mind, he's probably got a really good chance of making it back. I don't know. Controversial opinion? I guess. For the Smash Ballad, I'm glad Wolf didn't win it. What? Because even though I love the character, the last thing we needed was a clone to win the ballad. Yeah. Yeah, yeah that's true, actually. I would. I'd much rather have Bayonetta over Wolf. Yeah, I loved. But I much rather have Sha Shantae. I much rather have Shantae over Bayonetta. I, no, I love Bayonetta. So I was so excited when uh, they announced her. But. No, don't get me wrong. I was too, but um, I just I just like Shantae yeah. more. I was the guy who was excited for Karin more. Really? But, you know. <laughs> Man, it's because yeah, it's because I, I played. I was Bayonetta. super hyped for Fire Emblem Fates. I don't know. It's because I played Bayonetta. I was super I... excited. Yeah. But um, I thought uh, Bayonetta was gonna be trash. Yeah. Haha, <laughs> little did you know, she's the best character in the game. I was like 100% confident. I saw those combos and like, they're either not going to be true, they're going to be like 50-50s DI mix-ups, um, they're not going to kill, they're going to deal no damage. 
I thought all these things, that's gonna be like terrible neutral, all of that. She has the best fucking disadvantage in the game, debatably. The best advantage and a really good neutral. And I ate my shit for that. <laughs> I knew I knew she was broken the second that they I saw her combos, honestly. The second she had three jumps, I knew she yeah. was broken. Um oh ice climbers. They gotta put them back in. Because Oh yeah, of course. They're gonna they're definitely yeah. gonna put back ice climbers because because there's only one version of the game, and they're probably going to make it be able to yeah, work. Yeah, exactly. Yeah, definitely. I mean, Switch is more powerful than 3DS, right? So it shouldn't be too much of a problem. Oh, yeah. I think it's more powerful than the Wii U. Yeah. It is. Yeah, it shouldn't be a problem. Um... Got any hated characters that you think have a decent chance? <sighs> hated? Um, hated characters. Um... Olimar? This is a rough one because I normally don't hate characters. <laughs> I don't like Olimar. I really don't want him back in. You don't I don't. Like... Um, That's any so Fire Emblem character? Does that count? I, yeah, can I we, guess. Can I'm, we cut? I mean, they're probably gonna have a new Fire Emblem. Rep. Can we cut the All right, Fire so here's Emblem my, characters here's down my to like idea. maybe three or four? Because here's my idea: they get rid of, they only keep. Marth, um, Robin, and Ike uh, put Lin in the game. Not Lin. They I'm, cut out that's... everyone else. I I don't, I don't know. Put Sigurd in the game if you want. If you're that desperate. I don't think Lin deserves a spot. Why? Like, okay, hear me. I know she's super popular. I know everyone loves her, but gameplay wise, I feel like she'd be doing a Lucina. See. Like, I get she has different things to Marth, and realistically, okay, if you if I had to choose between Marth and Lin going in, like, without Marth's already, like, being in since Mela, I would say, yeah, put Lin in. But we're not losing Marth, because Marth's so iconic and staple. And I yeah, think that Lin would essentially be a Marth with Well, a that's not what Intelligent and Systems said, like you that... know? And Heroes. <laughs> <laughs> Where he's literally got, like, nothing, <laughs> heroes. and Lin Fuck has, heroes. like, five different versions of her. <laughs> Yeah, so we can just, like, copy-paste yeah. those. No problem. Right, other than that, I, I don't think Lin should be in. Just new Fire Emblem rep. And the three said, yeah, Mar Marth, Ike, and Robin. But they're probably not going to cut Corrin. See, I was thinking Silica. Because it... But I feel like she'd also be kind of like a Robin clone. A little bit. Yeah. Just put a healer in the game. Just put, I don't know, Cheryl. No. Why? Why do you want a healer? That, the mean girl from... I'd don't love Lisa as a healer in there. Healing plus axe, it's like... That's cool. Idea. See... <sighs> for... NK for Fire Emblem I reps. think I want Hector more than Lin, honestly. They remove all the Fire Emblem reps. No. You Except can't for hear. Marth. Except for Marth. Except no. for Marth. I, I... Robin's so cool, though. Like, just as a concept, in Smash. Dude, Ike is, Ike is also so popular, people would get really angry. Yeah. If I had to choose a Fire Emblem character to stay, not in, like, disincluding my bias from being a Marth main, I would say keep Robin. I'd probably say keep I'd Ike. I'd say keep Ike. Oh, okay. Rip. Right now. <laughs> so if I was Mr. Nintendo... Robin would be out. Yeah. No, I'd say Roy and Lucina would be out, definitely. Maybe, I don't know, Corrin? <sighs> Corrin is more unique, though. Okay, let's not get hasty. Let's not get hasty about uh, Roy. Nah. I, really, I mean, I kind I, of fucking hate playing as Corrin or playing against really? Corrin, real, like, to be honest. Corrin's not... Alright. Corrin, for me, it's like... Corrin has to, like, she's learning fair on air to get a combo start and has some, like, boring-ass-looking ladder with fair that deals, like, it, it's not not as exciting as, like, Bay like Bayonetta or Zero Suits. Yes, Bayonetta's, like, combos are exciting because you can actually get out of them now. Um, <laughs> it's just, like, a couple fairs, and it's, like, it doesn't feel interesting. Like, their hits feel really weak and pathetic. It's, like, nah, I'm not a fan of Corrin. I don't know. I like, I like the fair, idea. It's fair. Of, you know, dragon big boy, you know. 
Oh, I love the idea, but not how it was executed. We need a furry dragon in Smash no. 4 and Smash Witch. <laughs> <laughs> Oh yeah, you sent a picture of that earlier. I forgot about that. <laughs> Shut up. Don't be quiet. <laughs> uh, and Mr. 911 likes uh, scalies, everyone. There you go. Exposed. I, I, f I feel genuinely upset. <laughs> I am going to cannibalize your children. It's alright. If I had, like, permission to add one character and, like, no one could stop me, it didn't matter what they were from, and everyone could hate me for it, I would add um, Kuropika from Hunter x Hunter. But... I thought it was called Hunter x Hunter. <laughs> I know I... Oh, uh, yeah, Hunter <laughs> <laughs> I normally call it Hunter x Hunter. This one time, I'm like, I'm gonna call it Hunter x Hunter while it's being recorded. Wow. Fuck. <laughs> um, um, if I could add a character without any sort of repercussion or anyone stopping me, who would I add? I'm... Hmm, that's a that's actually a really tough question. I want Deku. Because there's so many options. Dude. No! My hero's decent. No, Sora. I really want Sora. I forgot to Sora I forgot to mention cool. that earlier. I definitely want Sora in the game. Because, you know, um I don't know, it's kinda unlikely though, because as we know right now, KH3 is not coming to the Switch. So it's yeah. Uh, it wouldn't be like oh, that's the same thing I have with Joker. Like Persona Five is not yeah, the Switch either. So yeah, that's the thing. And I don't really, I don't feel like someone per from Persona could even get in the Smash because how would that work? I mean, you can use like, you know, like the arena um, move set, right? But it doesn't really. That wouldn't really work in Smash. I feel. You could just kind of have a spellcaster thing like Robin, but with a more like thief-like playstyle with the melee, and then just have like persona abilities, um, or just personas in general showing up as your moves. Like, I like have Jack Frost for an ice attack, just fucking pull out of your back like a stand. I guess, yeah, yeah. But uh, yeah, I feel like that's kind of unrealistic because you know there's usually like. Oh, this character has a good chance because this character has uh, a game on a Nintendo console, right? Like Shantae. Like Shantae had a good chance oh, yeah, because okay. her game was on Wii U, right? But I don't know. Sora, Sora's yeah, kind of yeah. out of the question. That's one of my dream characters, I guess. Yeah. Speaking okay, I have my character. Oh, yeah, go. My dream dream character is probably either going to be um, Fukua from Skullgirls. Or what's the what's the face? Uh, I forgot the character, so I'm just gonna say Kratos from God of War. <laughs> <laughs> uh, imagine a Skull Girls character in Smash, though. That would be cool. I mean, Bayonetta's in Smash. That'd be really interesting, actually. Yeah, because like the move set's already made for them. Yeah. All they gotta do is just port it for Smash and give it like Smash physics abilities. What do you guys think of um, a character from Project Octopath Traveler? Oh yeah, yeah, yeah! yeah. I totally not... forgot about that. Yeah. Yeah, I hear. I see no one talking about. It. Everyone's talking about like the predictions. Oh, this character's gonna make it or something. It's like, I mean, Nintendo's been pushing this pretty yeah, hard. Yeah, I totally so, like, forgot I think about a that. Really solid chance. Also, is that the f uh, final working pro uh, product f name for the uh, game? I think it's just Octopath Traveler. Ignore the project. Mm. Mm. I honestly like that name. Yeah, I'm honest. I'm honestly not too familiar with the um, Octopath Traveler. You can get a demo on the Switch for free. That would imply I yeah, have a exactly. Switch. Exactly. <laughs> I don't oh. even have a Switch actually. <laughs> <laughs> you guys don't have Switches. I Aqua, I am poor. Yeah, I want Peter Griffin from Family Guy and Smash yeah. Switch. Can we get uh... <laughs> actually like? Can we get Freddy Freaker? Oh uh, wait, what were you saying? I kind of want Freddy Freaker, honestly. <laughs> all right, all right. So, connecting to the Family Guy thing you said. All right, 
if Nintendo wanted to get the most popular character they possibly could <laughs> that has a game on the Switch and is being represented on the Switch, which character Goku. would they go with? The At most the moment, well I feel like the most popular character in the game in the world right now is, Th is Thanos. More popular than that. More well known. Uh, Scooter Man. More well known than Thanos at the moment. More well known than that. Um, uh, man, you, you you're making this a yeah. doozy on us. That 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 is on the Switch playable oh, right okay. now. Oh, on, on the Switch. Switch playable. Well, they already added Inkling, so yeah. Even even more popular than Inklings. Do you have this in mind? Uh. Paulina yeah. from Super Mario Odyssey. No, more popular. I had this in mind. Yeah. Uh, ooh, what? You... Just tell yeah, us, just tell a South Park rep. That's not. Oh, isn't the fractured butthole on Switch? Yeah, it is, and it has exclusive DLC for the Switch. I'm looks just like saying. Our... Looks like we have our our character. Yeah. I'm just saying. I'm if it guaranteed. happens, if it happens, I fucking called it. I guess it could be like a replacement. Uh, uh, if it happens, I will PayPal you like yeah. twenty bucks. Uh, <laughs> like my you my will... predictions that I haven't heard anyone else say, and I think have a decent chance, is like Cartman. Well, okay, not not a decent chance for South Park. That's kind of a funny joke. But <laughs> yeah. Cartman and an uh, Octopath Traveler ca character. But I mean, they could also add Kyle instead of Cartman. See, I was gonna one. I was gonna yeah. say, isn't South Park like a little too mature? But I forgot Bayonetta. You know. Yeah. And and Snake was in the yeah. game at one point. Bayonetta and Cloud kind of just opened up to everything yeah. being possible. Honestly, mm -hmm. I was so surprised about Cloud. I really did not expect that at all. That really did. I think that was the start of like I, anything I is possible, really. Yeah. Okay, my take on it was I knew um, Cloud would come to Smash eventually, but I did not think it would be Smash, Smash for the Wii U. Yeah, I, mean, I thought I was becoming like that where you was gonna be the last game to be honest. I was too. Then Sakurai was like, "Yeah," and then he um gave us a new Smash game. Yeah. Yeah. Who's the most popular fictional character in the world right now? Mario, I think. <sighs> Mickey Mouse. Oh yeah, Mickey. Yeah. We if if. God? If Epic Mickey, God. If, if, <laughs> wow. Oh well. All right. So I'm gonna need you to calm down a little bit, Aqua. Yeah, uh, we're we're getting demonetized. Boys. Um. <laughs> <laughs> sorry, sorry, sorry. No, I I I it's it's I know Banned it's funny. It, it'd be funny. <laughs> that um, just broke everything up. <laughs> that just completely like. I, sorry, yeah, I, sorry. I I I don't, I don't know yeah. what else to say. <laughs> Whoops. Um. Dude, Steve from Minecraft. What about joke character? What about joke characters? How what kind of joke characters would you want to see? Steve from Minecraft could very well make it in and is kind of That's a joke true. character. I mean. I'm de putting my money on Steve too. By money, I mean my dignity. <laughs> oh, yeah, my. Minecraft's what dignity was Switch, there to begin so with? He, he's got a chance. And it's popular. Yeah. And it's. I want to see Hero Brian and, and Smash. With kids, so. It's the it's the second most popular game in the world right now. All right, I'm calling Sans too. By no. the way, no. Sans, Sans, I love Sans no. Undertale. S Sans is if, getting in Smash. If Sans is in Smash, I will uh, eat my hair. I'll eat my flex tape. I will, I will eat my fucking flex tape. <laughs> <laughs> I want I want uh, Chalk from John Tron in Smash. I want Grimbo. <laughs> And that's what you have the Miis for. You can put anyone that's in Smash That's true, now. yeah. Anyone you want. But uh, they won't be a true character. Got him. I want Juan. I want Juan Dissimo in Smash. That would be really cool, actually. Dude, why aren't there more cartoons in Smash? Smash for Smash is going to be the start yeah. of it. Dude, I want... I want Goku I want, in Smash Four right now. If if Goku's in Smash Switch, I will actually quit being a Smash. Uh, Are you quit serious? Playing Smash. Uh, That's Goku... when I know we've. All right, hear me out. Hear me out. Goku has a decent chance. He does. He does. But if he's in the game, I will actually stop playing Smash. Dude, yeah. why? Why do you? Why don't you want Goku in Smash? 
two main reasons. One, I think Dragon Ball is a complete gar- Oh god, I died. Anyway, I think uh, Dragon Ball is complete garbage. I think Dragon Ball Super is hot garbage. And Dragon Ball Z is decent at best. Wow. That's fair. I've never watched Dragon I'd much, Ball. I'd much rather see a My Hero Academia and a Hunter Hunter character. I really want. I and, really uh, want Taku. Goku. Oh, I don't think anime is gonna make it in unless it's Goku oh, because of Dragon Ball Fighter Z. Tim. And also, I would prefer Goku over Deku to be completely honest, but. I'd much rather have. Okay, my two lists for characters. Don't put Goku in. That's it. <laughs> <laughs> That's the entire prerequisite. Nice. Uh, yeah, that's a pretty good prerequisite, honestly. I mean, I think Goku might make it. I don't know. Oh, if he makes it, then I will actually like, <laughs> die. I, like, I will have an aneurysm and die immediately. I think this is the year of third-party characters in Smash. I, see, I don't think that. I well, really do not think that. You don't think I think so. Alright, alright. I um, want Monica from Doki Doki Literature Club in Smash. Cool. Her, sm her, sm her final wouldn't. smash is just, uh, she breaks the game. She just she just deletes the entire game. Yeah. You have to buy it again. Grim. Wait, so, okay, why do you think that... Actually, hang on, sorry, let me start again. You said that you don't think this is going to be the year of third party for Smash. Oh, I say yeah, but yeah, whatever. Yeah. Alright. Answer. What are... Okay, so let's just say an average Smash game has eight newcomers, yes. yeah? Okay. Mm -hmm. And you know how Sakurai only likes to add characters that have a unique playstyle and are interesting, and not just popular ones, ones that would actually make the game better, yeah? Yeah. yeah. Alright, give me eight characters that are first party that would be interesting in Smash. Uh, Breath of the Wild, uh, Link mm -hmm. as one. Um... I say Midna. Midna would be That's pretty two. cool, honestly. Um, Ridley. But what would you really do with Midna that's different? Well, she's more... She's like a big boy grapple thing. She has a lot... A lot uh, let me try again. Take two. She has more disjointed hitbox than every other character, making her extremely broken. But we already have that with Shulk, Banned though. in every tournament. Yes, but like make Midna good. I don't think making characters good or not is a good enough reason I to justify like, them I in feel Smash. Like <laughs> have really good grapple mechanics. But we already have Bowser and DK. I'd say Wolf. I'd say Wolf Link, but that'd just be controversial. And I would. S Either well, my point was, I I personally think it's hard for there to be many unique characters that aren't really obscure that are first party that could make it into Smash that Sakurai would consider interesting enough to implement. Also, uh, can we let's go back to characters we like, want to talk about for a second? So they really like, want Bandana D in game, in the game. Uh, yeah. That that is all. Since I don't want to view the topic oh, too much. Oh, we're not even thinking about arms, dude. They could put like, oh yeah, Sintel or uh, Min Min or uh, Ribbon Boy or no Ribbon Girl or whatever. <laughs> you know. We could have like arms reps, but like no one likes arms apparently. I think, I I think don't an know. arms rep would be cool. I'm, you I know, like one arms. arms rep. Yeah, I want one. at least two. Like, I want like Twintel and um, Springman, not Springman. Um, Ribbon Girl and Twintel and uh, what's her name? A Ribbon Man can be the just like a costume for, for yeah. the same character. Since I think they play yeah, the same, I'm like, not sure. I mean, every character has their difference. No, they can just make like a, they can just How make small? like a general arms character, right? And just, yeah, yeah. And just put skins with them. I feel like that'd be hard unless, um, unless they choose characters of the same size. Since they have a uh, robot oh, girl, yeah. then you True. have a mummy boy. They're Maybe they could put like two two arms reps, uh, um, an arm like midweight and an arm heavyweight. I don't think you need two arms reps. They like the arms gimmick is probably enough for one character, but I couldn't see it branching out unless it was a clone. Yeah, that's, that's fair. fair. But you know, Martha and Lucina, right? 
<laughs> Hi, fellas. But clone. Martha Lucina Roy. Again, clone. <laughs> I mean, I. Roy's. Yeah, Roy's a clone, yeah. He's not the biggest of clones. He's less of a clone than Lucina, definitely. Shout out to Enzi. Yeah. I feel like. I just. I like Roy. I think we should take out Lucina put, and See, leave I... Roy in. That's I... my thoughts. I support Lucina being in Smash. I support it. I do it. not. It. She was. She was important for about one game. But I mean, her playstyle more. Can like I see. I get people like, oh, she's just a clone. See, but... I would like it if they completely changed her playstyle into something new. All I see is all I see for Lucina is a Marth for people who are bad at Marth. Not. That's, necessarily that's all I see. it's that's a, all I really see Lucina from it's a more consistent and like a more consistent and easier to pick up math and I would almost say better math like there yes. are situations where like coming from someone Wait. who's played math since the beginning of the game there are situations where it's really really hard to get a tipper consistently. Like, no matter what you say about how good you are at spacing, there are things like, hey, if my opponent performs this move right when I hit them, it doesn't matter if, like, um, it hits me or not, they might shift their hurt box, so now I don't get the tipper anymore. Really small things like that can just really fuck up your tipper, and it makes it, like, hard to be like, why am I even bothering? Because if one hitbox that isn't the tipper hitbox... If a hitbox that isn't the tipper one connects as well as the tipper one, the tipper one will be cancelled. This is kind of getting into the coding of it because I've done modding. But... It... Yeah, I would say to an extent we've seen this better. But that's so would you topic, rather sorry. take the tipper mechanic out or like extend the tipper? I would prefer how... keeping the tipper, but changing how it works, so it's... If so make like the tipper stronger... box really small, but as long as you connect it, no matter, even if you hit the sour spot as well, it will just ignore the sour spot and go to the sweet spot, rather than vice versa. Kind yeah, that's of... what I would uh, think how it, how it would work originally, mm -hmm. but yeah. it doesn't apparently. Yeah, no, nah, it doesn't. Yeah. Which is really annoying. I, I get why they did it, but it's still really annoying. They should just give like, us back Melee Marth. I think Melee Marth still had it too. I don't know. No, I mean, just make him good. I don't like, like Melee Marth. Melee Mar Marth's lame. I don't know. I've never played Melee, honestly, so. Um, what I. What they could do is. I like the transformation bit with Zelda and Nah uh, Sheik, and I feel like they should bring that back, but I doubt I doubt that's gonna happen, personally. Mm. S since they seem pretty keen on their um, idea of uh, Sheik and Zelda being completely separate characters. I couldn't see that being done unless both Zelda isn't the Breath of the Wild incarnation this time, and if. Both characters actually had enough to complement each other in playstyle. I really want Breath of the Wild Zelda, honestly. I just want her to be a skin and nothing more. Since I don't, I don't. If memory serves me right about Breath of the Wild, we didn't see much of her to begin with. We seen her do like about two things, and that's about it. Capture Ganon and. But you get a, but you get I think a thick Zelda. <laughs> I don't <laughs> you like you. Think Zelda, you know. <laughs> That's a valid point, but it's oh, not man. valid enough. Let's bring yes, Love Live characters yes. to Smash. Honestly, yes. no. That was a joke. I don't Nozomi like and Mari for Smash. Speaking of like music stuff, what music? Music. Do you want? Oh, oh my god, yeah. that's like a. I want to see a more like lo-fi slash jazz vibe the nah. songs this time around but i really i just think they're gonna bring like a the normal version of a song just like a standard remix of it no you gotta go with the hip kids yeah. oh, hip-hop you know 
You gotta, you, you, you gotta rap. I wouldn't like, be, that. I wouldn't be, I wouldn't be against seeing a hip hop version of you each song. You gotta go with a. But I want it to be more relaxed. Right. You gotta song. go with a rap theme song, you know. I'm kind of the opposite. I feel like the music in like in battle needs to be more intense. Me too. Because I mean, like epic you, orchestras no. or something. Yeah, I like even, I do some of it. I prefer yeah. rock. Like metal, a little bit, not like a little bit metal, like rock and roll. Just something a little bit more. I want to see more like. I want. I want more pronounced, authentic instruments to smash. I don't mind. And I don't. I, I don't like. I just like hearing the like. An old like busted down drum set being hit on. It's just my own. It's just my personal mm. preference. I'm a weird person. I can't say I know what yeah. it really even sounds like, but <laughs> you never heard you never heard of worn down, worn down drums being beat on. I've heard of other things being beat on. Haha. Uh -huh. But no. Get it? Because that was a joke. Oh, Rayman. Rayman would be pretty cool. <laughs> 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 I forgot Rayman yeah. existed. When was his last game? It was game? Legends, which was like... I don't know. I mean, that was on the Wii U. It was like a couple years ago. Hmm. I... Yeah, it's for... The, oh, wait. Ubisoft. Oh, yeah, that's true. Kind of yeah. shuts that down immediately. Wait, what's with the Ubisoft from? Ubisoft is very tight-lipped about, the, about their IPs. Except when it comes to Mario and Rabbids. Yeah, that's what reason. I was saying. I mean, oh, Rabbids, Rabbids no. and Smash, Minion <laughs> Smash. Okay, I I don't want it. Yeah, but it's, it's possible. Awesome. It's yeah. very possible. Uh, let's talk about good things now. I mean, we uh, good things. Good things. Good. We get a new so game. So not Smash Four. What? We get a new game. That's good. That is a good thing. A game is coming but, this year. But what if it's a bad game? We still have Wii U. Wii U still a decent game. That's true. Yeah, you're well, right. I thought you hated Wii U. No, me? uh, oh, me? Oh. Oh, no. I said in my video, which you can watch, oh, link in the description, that it's a, um... <laughs> It's a very, it's, I said it's a decent game at best, and that's just to rile yeah. people up. It's more so just to get I people angry. That. Than I forgot it was more of a joke. Just. Is anyone even yeah. watching your video? It's, it has more, th uh, let me just flex on y'all, it has more than yours. Yeah, yeah I know. Right, what? But. <laughs> I don't even upload to that. Ignore. I, okay. Ignore the fact that half those views are mine. Yeah, okay. Okay, yep. Which is fine. <laughs> <laughs> hey, that's what happens in life, right? You steal someone oh. else's content and you get more views. Yeah. Shout out to FoozyTube. <laughs> Does anyone have any closing thoughts or anything? Closing thoughts? Yeah. Please make Smash Switch for a good game. That's usually the yeah. plan. <laughs> I don't know, because I played Sonic, I played, uh, Sonic games recently and... Uh... I mean, I just I... want uh, more of a, again, as I mentioned in my video, I'll just sum up briefly, like, more darker, more competitive, like, more contrast. Not real darker, I mean, like, edgy anime darker. Not edgy anime. Um, uh -huh. High contrast colors there darker. That's what I mean more. Yeah, um, I agree. Competitive modes that encourage fun things like a different, like, character per stock kind of mode or, like, an organized crew battle kind of mode. Things like that. A bring back tournament, but for a local multiplayer, and make it more like nuanced, like adding uh, best yeah. of threes or something. Yeah, yeah I really want yeah. them to uh, revamp the tournament I... a bit. Uh, like, final. Uh, let's throw in one final thought because I'm really trying to stretch this audio out. I'm to trying to stretch it out to an hour. hour. Should be. Um, <laughs> Well, I started l later than you since I constantly restarted and ended to get a, a couple seconds of silence. It's going to be easier to edit and post. Characters. Last character. Um, hold up. One second. Something's going on.
Ah. Uh, uh, character was for Smash. All right, <laughs> give me a second. <laughs> um, I want to see Pauline, Midna and Wolf Link, uh, Rabbit Peach, Rayman, Waluigi. No. Um, Toadette, Pearl Marina, Crystal from Star from Star Fox Adventures. Uh, Helix from Arms. And um, Isaac from Golden Sun. Um, oh, wasn't where? Come on, Captain Rainbow from Captain Rainbow. <laughs> wasn't Isaac from um, the Tales of Symphonia um, really popular? I'm talking about I know, Isaac but from I'm Golden about... Sun. Don't you mean Lloyd? Oh, oh my God, Lloyd! Yeah. Oh my God, I'm such an idiot. <laughs> I want no, you to leave it too. Although Microsoft, you know. Yeah. I... Bro, any closing I mean... thoughts? Um. I want to die. The mayo, ah, same. Funny. Ah. Yo, you know, I want. I have some closing thoughts for the uh, seven people that are gonna watch this video. Why are you watching this? So if you guys could do, if you guys could do me a solid and um, go to my YouTube page, link in the description. You can totally watch my all right, legitimate. All right, I'm joking. Stop, no, thoughts no, no. and.